Loom has just made some amazing updates to their platform and I'm coming in with a series of videos to go over them with you. So let's get to it. In this second video, what I wanted to feature is a new feature that Loom has added. And I think to me, in my opinion, in my humble opinion, I think this now has taken Loom to the next level and they're now competing with the big boys. And by big boys, I mean platforms like Wistia and Vidyard. And the reason for that is because if you're familiar with Wistia or even with Vidyard, you know that they now have a tool that sort of competes with Loom. It has the ability for you to quickly create screen recordings and share them with your um, audience. And Vidyard in particular has one where it's embedded into Gmail just like Loom does. So the other thing that those two platforms do that a lot of people will use those platforms for is for the purpose of hosting videos so that they don't have to use a free platform like YouTube and then risk the possibility of um, having somebody see the video that they didn't want to have see the video. So now with Loom, if you go here to new video, you'll see that if you click here, you're gonna be able to record a video like I'm recording now, but now you can actually upload a video. So if you click here, it then tells you you can drag or drop your videos, or you can click on the browse and then find it on your computer. Now they support a wide variety of files. They can do M sorry, WMV, AVI, uh, WebM, MP4, MOV files that as long as they're less than four gigs, which four gigs, gigs is massive, um, then you're good to go. So all you need to do is click here and then you can just click on wherever the video is and then you can upload it. So actually let me walk you through that. I've already done a sample video, but I'm gonna do this one just so that you can see. This is gonna take a, a while to process. Oh, that, that must have been really short because I thought it was going to take longer to process, but it's processing. So I'll come back here and we'll close this out and I'll go to one that I've already uploaded um, previously. As you can see, that one's processing and uh, this one was done already. Sorry. So this is the one that I've already uploaded. So now you don't have to actually only be able to send videos from Loom using videos that you've actually created using the Loom platform. You can now actually upload videos to Loom and then share them that way. And you obviously can share them by clicking on the share button. You can copy the link, you can copy or get the link GIF, you can embed it. So this can be embedded on your website, which is usually what you would want to do something like use something like this for, or you can actually send it via email now. So to me, this is an absolute and utter game changer. So I wanted to make sure that you guys knew about this new feature of being able to upload your own videos to Loom. All right, so I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.